All right, today we are doing a review on Tradlands. This video is not sponsored and I purchased this with my own money. Tradlands focus is on well-made garments in quality fabrics that are easy to take care of and are durable. They claim their manufacturing process is responsible and the garment workers are paid a living wage in clean environments. There's a couple of items I wanted to try from Tradlands, but my first purchase is the Glen Long Short in the emerald colorway. This is actually my first time with tensile, as in the branded fiber, which is generically called Lyocell. They are constructed of a 30% linen and 70% tensile blend. I really enjoy the way this fabric feels in my hands. It has a cool hand feel along with a light velvety and silky touch as I run my fingers across it. It has a slight texture to the weave and both a matte and very subtle sheen to it. It feels like a sturdy fabric and it has a satisfying drape and it feels fluid. The waistband is thick and fully elasticated. It's stitched in a way that the elastic will not twist on the inside of the band and it's finished nicely. And there is piping that runs down the side of the shorts and around the leg openings and that's finished nicely too. The pockets are finished well and the seams on the inside are finished well also. However, I did notice this pair has a lot of loose threads like a strange amount of them. These threads didn't seem like they would affect the integrity of the garment, but it was just kind of weird, especially juxtaposed with all the care it seems was taken to finish the rest of the garment. I did find one area of stitching on the leg that had a skipped stitch and the backside looked like it could be fraying. This was for sure something that could affect the integrity of the seam and I didn't want to have to repair a brand new pair of shorts, so I opted to exchange so we could try again. And here is the new pair. I am wearing a size small. I tried the extra small, but the elastic was just a tad tight for my preference. The fit is very high-waisted which i was hoping for and even still there is length in the legs which i love and the waistband hits around two inches above my belly button i've already washed this pair they were easy to wash and they dried quickly i can update on its durability after more time and more washes but my lack of experience with the fabric leaves me feeling cautious and I've only washed the shorts using the Delicate Cycle and in a garment bag. And here I am about to take them out for their first spin. I'm pairing them with a half tucked cream colored silk noil drop shoulder boat neck tee and a floral patterned robe jacket, some gold jewelry and my blush patent teaks. I really really love this outfit the pairing is my favorite go-to right now and the proportions are nice and i feel pretty and flowy and comfortable and here i am after about 10 hours um mostly sitting at work i was very curious to see how much the fabric would wrinkle during the day I would consider this a light to medium amount of wrinkling, especially if you compare it to 100% linen. So not bad at all in my opinion. This is my favorite linen blend fabric that I have tried so far. So I was simultaneously impressed and unimpressed with Tradlands. My emotions were bittersweet in the beginning, but after I got the exchange and after the ease of washing, drying, and wearing the shorts, I decided I love these shorts. Oh yeah, you guys, we hit 200 subscribers. Thank you for that. Thank you. Thanks for sticking around and hanging out with me. I hope to see you again soon.